The following is content for adult collectors. This content is not intended for children. Welcome back to G Boats Pop Vinyl. I am, of course, Steve, and uh, we went to the six this weekend. If you don't know what that is, that is the new slang word for Toronto because they're in the 416 area code. So we went down to the six. We hung out with our friend Tom, and uh, it was a good weekend. And first of all, big shout out to Tom and Vince at the Grunts and Grumbles podcast. Um, I was their guest this weekend on the podcast. The new episode should be out tomorrow. I'm going to put up all the information below for the Grunts and Grumbles podcast down below in the comments. You can check out that podcast. We talk lots of stuff. We talk Funko Pops. We talk The Boys Season 2. Um, we talk all kinds of fun stuff. Um, so make sure you turn into the Grunts and Grumbles podcast um, link and description and stuff is below. Before we get started here, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Give this video a share and uh, let us know in the comments below after this is all over what you thought about it. So let's get into this video. This started off um, with a pop before we even left town. Um, our good friend Tom uh, that I just talked um, brought me the last pop I needed to complete a set. Um, and if you saw us on Instagram, you know what this is. It is the Box Lunch Metallic Deadpool from the Marvel 80th set. This, of course, is the International Edition. Um, and uh, there we go again. Show it there. And uh, this is it. This completes the Marvel 80th or Marvel 80 Years Funko Pop set for me. The set is now complete. Um, I'm going to put pictures up on Instagram later this week um, with the full set, similar to what I did when I completed the Captain Marvel set um, a couple months ago. Stay tuned for that. All right, next off. Um, so we did a few trips. We did some hunting on Saturday. We did some hunting on Sunday. Um, so everything's a mishmash. But I'll let you guys all know here. We bought our first hot toy. That's right. We bought our first hot toy. We'll get to that in just a bit. First off, we're going to get to this bag right here, which is from EB Games. And I believe, yes, this bag is from this morning, uh, from Sunday morning. Um, this is uh, first one, and it is a couple, as you know, I've started collecting Power Rangers Lightning Collection. And it is the Beast Morphers Red and blue lightning collection figures super super excited uh to get these and add these to my collection with my gold beast morphers uh power ranger which i have um i don't know if they've released the yellow one i don't think so maybe they have i'll have to look at my list um but yeah add these to the list of power rangers lightning collection figures that i now have next up is uh, let's do this EB Games bag that we went yesterday. We got another EB Games bag here, and this was from Saturday. Um, and I was super happy because, one, Boats was able to complete a set today. She was able to grab the Sean the Sheep to go with her Wallace and Gromit. So she is super, super happy to have that in her collection. Now, that now finishes the Wallace and Gromit wave one of boats's favorites and i was able to continue getting the new uh star wars video game pops um so i was able to pick up the hooded yoda from eb games very excited to have that so now i have darth malak and hooded yoda so i'm still missing darth revan and the shadow storm trooper um next on we will go to this hot topic bag Hot Topic bag. First item out of here actually isn't from Hot Topic. It's from Toys R Us. Um, I'm super happy to have it. And if you know us here, um, how much 
we love the child, Baby Yoda. We picked up the new Mandalorian and Baby Yoda Brickheads Lego set here. And we are super happy to have that. That's the back of the box. Let's show the front of the box here. Baby Yoda in his pram and the Mando there in Brickheads format for Lego. Excited to put this together. If you want to see a build video of this, let me know in the comments section below. And uh, maybe I can uh, do that for you. Let me know in the comments below. Build video for this. Do you want to see it? Let me know. And then, yes, we did go to Hot Topic uh, both days, but we only got something yesterday um, on Saturday. First up, because here the pops are 3 for 33. Um, Boats was able to get another one in her uh, set for um, Nightmare Before Christmas. She was able to get Witch from Nightmare Before Christmas. Uh, we were able to also get the Biggie in Fedora. And then the third one we got three for 33 was the reissue Glow in the Dark Pinhead. Yes, very excited to get this Glow in the Dark Pinhead. I know a lot of people are really, really mad that they're reissuing some of these because the prices on them are dropping, but uh, I'm happy to get this Pinhead finally. And then, of course, we also hit up their clearance shelf. Um... We were able to pick up the New York Comic Con Madame Maxime for only $12. Um, so we are happy to get that. I will add this to our Harry Potter collection. Specifically more my um, Hagrid collection. Because I love Robbie Coltrane. And, you know, it's the only pop of Robbie Coltrane I can get right now. Because they don't make Nuns on the Run pops. Funko make it happen. And then the last pop in here was from my friend Tom to Katie um, because Tom's a nice guy and he decided to give it to Katie. It is the Diamond Collection Snow White. Um, so big shout out to Tom. Thank you from Boats. This Diamond Collection uh, Snow White is actually pretty awesome. Really, I actually like it. Um, this is one of the better Diamond Collection pops out there. And ladies and gentlemen, told you at the beginning we bought our first hot toy um i know i didn't think i was ever gonna uh buy a hot toy because of the price but the price on this was awesome i could not uh could not pass it up so of course being in toronto we have a couple disney stores and disney stores have some hot toys here, at least. I don't know about the states. And, of course, we were able to get this baller Imperial Disney Store tote bag. Super, super happy. So, let me pull it out here. Yep, our very first ever hot toy. The Child with Hover Pram Cause, baby. Oh, I got you there, didn't I? You thought it was going to be a big hot toy. Oh... But it is still a hot toy. This is made by Hot Toys. And we are so happy to have the Child and Hover Pram Hot Toy. It's going right on the Baby Yoda shelf. So there we go. There is our haul um, for this weekend in Toronto. It was a good weekend. We had a great time. Uh, make sure you check out our friends uh, Tom and Vince at the Grunts and Grumbles podcast. Information is uh, down below. Um, Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you give this video a share. Make sure you let us know uh, what you thought in the comments below. What was your favorite poll from all this uh, big haul over the weekend? Was it the Child and Mando Lego? Was it the Child Cos Baby Hot Toy? Was it the Glow in the Dark Hot Topic exclusive Pinhead? Was it this box of Whip It um, cookies? Like, let us know in the comments below. What did you love in this video? And until next time, ladies and gentlemen, keep it popping.